downloaded a video from the internet and then seen that it's an FLV file and you need to convert it, but you don't know what kind of converter to use. Well, I'm going to show you a couple of converters and they're all free. So the first one, if we go over here, you'll see mediaconvert.com. Now, this is an online media converter, which is great and it's easy to use. What you've got to be careful of, there's stacks of adverts all over the place. There's Google AdWords, there's all kinds of stuff. Forget all of that, you can just come in. Yeah, it's easy to use. It'll just go in, it'll browse, look for the file that you want. You click on that, and then it'll say, what kind of output do you want? And you can choose any kind of output. So it's really easy to use. But let me take you to my favorite one. I use this one all the time. And this one is called Quick Media Converter. Now, you'd get this from Cocoon Software. If you go into cocoonsoftware.com, now be careful over here. It says AVS Converter Download Now. Uh, it's not free. Once you try it out, they try to get you to pay for it. So be careful of that. Rather go in here where you see where the arrow is. You click on that. You'll download Quick Media Converter. And this is what it looks like. It's so easy to use. Converts any kind of file. So the first thing you would do is you go in and you would find your file. So I would just go and I would look. I would find any file over here. Uh, the next thing you're going to do is you're going to see where you want to actually save that file. So you go in there. It'll ask for the output. Where do you want to save that file? So you would click that over there. Then you go up to the top here. What do you want to convert it to? So your converted file, and a lot of the times it's going to be to WMV. Windows Media Player will play this all the time. But there's also lots of others over here, DIV, DIVX, uh, if you want to put it onto a DVD, there's all the different DVD formulas. And also, if you just want to get the sounds, just click on that over there and you can just turn it into an MP3. So you'll drop down, you'll choose whichever one you want to, you'll click into that. And then all you do is you go in and you hit the convert button. It'll take about a minute or so. As soon as it's converted, you can open up the file and there it is, converted. Quick Media Converter, simple and easy to use.